Hi, welcome to Mahjong for Friends. This is our first play along where we're going to do a brief introduction to Chinese, Hong Kong, Japanese style Mahjong. You can play along with me. So if you want to go to mahjongforfriends.com in your web browser, and you can play directly in your web browser, or you can download an app uh, from the App Store or from Google Play. So since you're going to be playing along today, we're going to use a file that I've already saved. So I want you to click that save, use save file. And then I want you to click on this blue line tutorial. Then click on the green line for Chinese. And then that first white line was tutorial Chinese. And you can just go ahead and dismiss that screen there. And what you have here is a Mahjong game that you're going to play along with me. Okay, so what we have here is the game board. Uh, we are North Wind, so you'll be playing uh, playing my hand. East Wind always goes first, so East Wind is over here, bot one, and bot one through a two bamboo. So we have to decide what to do here. Uh, so first of all, let's just take a look at our hand. Um, these are circles. If you hover over it, see what they are. So we got three suits, circles, bamboos, and characters. And then there are honors tiles, which are dragons and winds. The object of the game is to get uh, four sets of three. And those sets can either be um, all one suit and the same number, so like three one circles. Or they can be sequences that have to be in the same suit and sequential numbers, uh, like a two, three, four. And sequences can only be three long. So we're trying to get uh, four of those and then a pair. Uh, and we can only take a tile if we can actually immediately use it. So we cannot use that two bamboo. So you just hit the proceed button. So go ahead and hit the proceed button. So anytime we see a tile that appears here that we cannot immediately use in our hand, you're just going to hit proceed or you can hit the space bar. So hit proceed on the nine bamboo. Now you see we've, we're moving around here. So now it's bot three's turn. And they're uh, red. Bots play really fast, which is good, but it'll be tough to keep up with here in the play along. So go ahead and hit proceed. So now what you see is it became our turn, and the new tile, the two circle, came into our hand. That was a draw from the wall. And now we have three two circles, which is great. Um, if you have uh, three of a kind in your hand, you keep them in your hand. They're worth more points in your hand. So we just keep those in and we need to discard a tile. And so I'm strongest in circles and bamboos, so I'm gonna throw that uh, two character first. So you just tap on the tile and then hit the proceed button. And at that point then, um, if no one takes it, the turn keeps going around. So in the two character you see that I threw uh, just comes out here into the discard pile. And so you continue to hit uh, proceed um, as these throws come as long as we can't use them. So the nine bamboo we can't use. So it keeps going around, becomes our turn, six circle. Again, we can't use it. Um, so I'm going to continue throwing the characters. So tap the four character, hit proceed. Ah, so you see the bot one took that. So you, now we can see some of what he's doing over here. You've got the four character uh, pong. Um, and he threw a six bamboo that we can't take. Can't take the three circle. Ah, now we get the seven bamboo. We can take that. So just tap those two tiles, hit proceed, and you can see the seven bamboos are out here. And to the rest of the players, it looked just like this. They can actually see that. They don't know we have these two circles, but they know we have that seven bamboo. And we need to do a throw, so we'll continue working through these characters. So seven character. And then just keep hitting proceed on these um, since we don't need them. Um, okay, so we have the circles here. and we, we can sequence these. So I'm going to go ahead and throw the uh, white dragon at this point then because those are sequence opportunities. Um, so we don't want this. Ah, all right, so the two circle. Uh, in this case, we're going to do something called a Kong. So we're going to put all three of them out and we're going to get a Kong. Now notice what happens then is we get another tile in. The reason why is because we're looking at these sets of three 
and this is sort of an extra tile. And I still need to be able to make two more sets of three in a pair. So I had to get a replacement tile. Uh, but I didn't like that one they gave us, that five character. So let's go ahead and discard him. So we keep playing, just keep hitting for C until something shows up that you like. Ah, so here we have a five circle. And it's thrown by bot three, which is very important when it comes to sequencing. We've been taking those pongs and kongs from anyone, but a sequence to take has to come from the player immediately before us so that nobody loses their turn for a sequence. Um, but since bot three threw that, we just tap the four and the six, and now we have our sequence, the four, five, six. So at this point, we really only need one tile for Mahjong. So we're gonna throw that eight circle, and we're gonna be looking for a one circle or a four bamboo. So about one through a seven bamboo, you're probably saying, can I make this into a Kong? Um, and that actually works the same way as that sequence where we would have had to get it from bot three to make to add that in after the fact. Uh, if it was still in our hand, we can take it from anyone. But once we've exposed this, it needs to come from bot three. So we're just going to continue to hit proceed until we can hopefully win this. Um, so just continue to hit proceed and we're going to throw the east wind. Um, you see now this, uh, this bot took the east wind, which meant bot one lost his turn. And we'll continue uh, and hopefully we'll get lucky here. So just hit proceed until we see something we want. We don't want that, so tap that. Ah, uh-oh, this guy's getting a lot of honor styles out there. That's not good. All right, let's hope we can uh, win this before that bot gets any stronger hand there. Here we go. Okay, so we actually drew our own tile. Um, so we have that Mahjong hand now. So you keep all these tiles, and you keep them in your hand, and you hit Mahjong. So depending on which style you've chosen to play between Chinese, Hong Kong, Japanese, uh, the scoring that's built in uh, may be what you use, um, or you may just dismiss this and use uh, your own scoring. And I will discuss the different scoring techniques and the differences between the different styles of Mahjong and um, in, in future tutorials. But this, I think, is enough to get you started playing uh, the styles of Mahjong, which are won by having four sets of three, which are either the Pongs of three, Kongs of four, or what we call the Chows, the sequences like the four, five, six. Now to play your own game, go ahead and just end out of this game. And let's go ahead then, and you can choose between Chinese or American Mahjong. So choose Chinese, uh, any settings for your particular variant, and then go ahead and start a new game. And you see, whoa, I need to play this game. Five pretties. Awesome. <laughs> if you have any trouble at all, um, please uh, check out uh, the additional tutorials in this uh, series as I put them out, our Facebook page, or you can contact us at support at mahjongforfriends.com. Thank you.